For me, the joy of being an editor is really being able to feel like I've helped an author in some way. There's definitely a lot of my role that, it, that conforms with the, with the common stereotype of an editor, but there's so much more besides that I kind of never would have expected until I got into publishing. The start of the process really is receiving a submission from an agent of an exciting new book. And there's no better feeling than when you read something that you feel is going to be big and that you want to publish, and then feeling that it, it delivers on the promise of that initial pitch and that I remain as excited throughout. The next part of that process is really helping the author to understand what it feels like to read the book. And if I can effectively enough express that, they will understand that something needs to change and then it's, it's their creative genius that comes up with those changes. A day in the life of an editor actually can vary a lot. There's quite a lot of time at my computer with emails and communicating with people. There are lots of meetings, a covers meeting where as the editor, I will be responsible for briefing the designers on the cover for the new book. A big part of the job of an editor is actually a sort of project manager role. So liaising not only with author and agent, but also with all the teams internally within the publishing house. So sales, marketing, publicity, design, really to drive the book through the process. When it's for a book that you're passionate about, which, which is the lucky position we're in as editors, um, it's so exciting. But then sometimes something just something flies yeah, yeah, and you're like, yeah. oh, great. I've always loved reading, so to be able to be a part of the process of that book's creation is something incredibly special and an honour, really.